cheek. Uh, G specs. Looks like we're getting right on into it and starting up on Dreamland. Yeah. G specs sort of known for his really quick uh, speed in, this, in, in general. Um, so I'm wondering if Dash is gonna be used to a chic style like that. Very pluppy. Weird little grab flub there. So far, hasn't been able to connect with any of the grabs he's thrown out, so... Dash has been doing pretty solid in the neutral game, gonna take that first stock. I really like the spacing by Dash there, too. Like, shielding right at Sheik dash attack range. Sort of baiting out Sheik super solid. Oh, nice little tech there from Dash, but he is still gonna get punished. Juice Box looking to finish this up. He did not hit the ground, but he does make it back with the straight fire fox and then tournament winners to the platform. Juice Box gonna clean that one up. The, the needle is to grab the classic sheep get off the ledge option. Oh my god. Yeah, Dash's bears in the corner. Really solid even against Sheep. Oh, throwing out the, the option coverage with that up smash. He's gonna get another grab here and he throws it out again. Can't get the tech chase. He's hitting a lot of grabs, just not getting the follow-ups. He got a really nice follow-up in the first stock. Yeah. Oh, the draft that... almost pays dividends. <laughs> yeah, I don't even think Juicebox thought that was going to hit. He was super not ready to capitalize. <laughs> and now he's going to lose that stock. Unfortunate SD there. Really solid recovery there. And wow, he makes it back. Yeah, that was a phenomenal angle. Um, I thought you were right that he, he had done a great recovery. The problem was he upbeat just a little bit too high. So Juicebox was able to clip him and send him back out there. Um, and Juicebox closes out the stock, so it's dead even. Oh, wow, a little bit of a miscue there. Oh my god. Juicebox has been like over seven. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna keep looking for it though, because as soon as soon as Dash text in place, that's when that that's when that up smash is gonna connect. Really nice wave dash or dash back there. Dash. With a forward smash. Wait, he actually comboed with the forward smash into an edge guard. That was so sick. We'll take it. Okay, this is hard. She has no resources. Yeah, it has to burn needles there. Uh, yeah, just getting hit in that situation is super scary for she. Alright, well, it's it's last stock. I'm, I'm, I'm looking for Juicebox to hit a grab and actually nail the follow-ups this time. That would be that would be the clutch last stock thing to do. Uh, but right now, Dash is, is the one who's being careful in center. There's the grab. Okay, not a tech in place. Oh, hits the Great. little spacing and reads it. Oh, he tried to read a double jump too. Didn't get that one, but he has put on a huge amount of damage and that down smash might just have done it. Oh, unfortunate, but ends up getting the punish on that missed ledge dash. Really solid by G-Spox. It was all data. Clearly he was just uh, downloading them every time he down threw and uh, getting that data. Just waiting for the last stock to not miss any single follow-ups at the end there, uh, which yeah. he, he did do. Um, and didn't close it out in the cleanest way possible, but got the <laughs> got the what, what M2K calls the execution test. He F-tilted as uh, Fox tried to wave land on the stage. Is, is uh, execution test the M2K? No, nah, I just he, he was saying it a lot the last time I was on the on the mic with him. It's when when someone ledge dashes from the is someone's on the ledge and you're just like F-smashing the spot where they're going to ledge dash, or you're just like putting out a hitbox to punish right. the spot where they're going right, to ledge right, dash. Right, right, right. That is kind of a chub check slash execution yeah, test. Yeah, M2K is just like, that's the execution test. Like, <laughs> yeah, <it laughs> he's not wrong. <laughs> <laughs> you, you are hoping they do not hit their clean wave dash. Or yeah, ledge. and that's juice box ready to punish it. Got the F-tilt fair. Uh, so we're going to stadium. Okay. Really liking these drills, as said earlier by Ben. Um, yeah, sort of risky there by uh, G Spots. 
you, it's very tempting to go for that overshoot down smash on a dash dancing fox, but the reward is just uh, either you get a neutral loss or you get like uh, 10%. So it's, it's, it's not great unless they're right next to edge. Oh! <laughs> yeah. You just teched an up smash. Okay. Good stuff. <laughs> Oh, unfortunate. We're seeing use of drill even at the mid percents from Dash. Just like very willing to use drill, and I think that's really good. <laughs> yeah, he's been getting a lot of confirms out of it too. He's he's gotten oh yeah. As you're seeing that drill shine, uh, he's gotten some grabs out of it as well. Uh, and it's it's working out. He's got a really nice lead here. Uh, again, Juicebox unable to really find his way in and find these grabs uh, because Dash has just been playing this neutral game so solidly. Really good out of shield movement. Really good spacing on berries. This is a fox that would look very annoying for a sheep to uh, fight. Oh yeah, a hundred percent. That's even just watching it now. I'm just like, I would not want to be chic in this situation. Um, and the other thing Dash has been doing really well, and you mentioned this earlier, uh, shielding perfectly at that distance where Sheik would want to be dash attacking. Uh, he's gotten the shield on the dash attack and really hard punishes several times. Uh, Juice Box can answer back, get that stock. See what we can do with this grab. We haven't seen a great tech chase from Juice Box. Maybe this is the one. Outspaces wake up shine, amazing. Yeah, he's so good at those pivot grabs and those like really clutch situations. Baits the get up attack. Another great bait double jump landing. Can he finish? Oh, not quite. Oh my God, the the dare just beat. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, going for a read on these out-of-shield uh, movements, but at this point, I think Dash has been showing that he's willing to take the, the hit on shield and go for a, a drill or a counter hit. So the counterplay to that is like spacing around the shield, going for grab. Ooh, very yeah. clean movement there, by the way. That should be death. There it is. No DI on the up throw. Couldn't react in time. Still a full stock lead for Dash. <laughs> <laughs> Can't crouch cancel a grab, Dash just learned. <laughs> nice! Outspaces the drill out of shield. Going for down smash again. That looks so weird. It looked like Dash had his shield up, and then it Dash that worked. Oh my god. Well, he's made it last stock with that with that sick Dash attack confirm. He's got a grab here. Oh, he swaps to shield instead of crouch canceling it. Remember what I told you when uh, I said down smash gets you 10%? <laughs> he, he read the Dash back, got down smash, got 10%, and then lost. <laughs> yeah, well... Super unfortunate for Juicebox there, but you're absolutely right. As a, a bad neutral exchange, loses that stock, loses the game. We're going to game three. Um, yeah, I think both of them are playing pretty solid. Um, Juicebox needs to start playing around shield a bit more. And uh, I think Dash is using shield well. I, I think the, Tom hasn't shown that he's willing to challenge it as much, so... Like these, these shields, these uh, drills, really come in high reward for him. Um, yeah, absolutely agree. I think definitely the shielding from Dash has been netting him a lot more neutral wins than you expect, uh, especially versus Sheik. And there we go, Juicebox immediately with the grab this time, just coming in against the shielding Fox. Oh, the double needle there, this is huge. Okay. Oh my god, sick movement by Dash there. And that was a really tight situation. Juicebox just barely missing the needle that would have for sure gotten him that stock. He does have a huge percent lead after all of that. He was playing super solid with Dash being really smart, making his way back, keeping himself alive, and then oh. he gets battlefielded. <laughs> you chased it. That's my bad. It, you, we were talking about how good his movement was. Staying alive for so long, and then he just misses a quick up beast all to grab ledge. Um, oh, and now Juicebox has a crab again. Oh, all right, that's solid confirm there from Dash. Gonna keep the stocks even. 
good reset there. He, he's saying, okay, like maybe Juice Box is spacing outside my outer shield movement. Oh! Oh, he went so deep, but he did it all perfectly. That is your B and B solid Fox edge guard by Sheik. Good stuff to Juice Box. Okay, there the down smash did not hurt him as much. Well, he got the ten percent. <laughs> <laughs> it was worse. <laughs> it was worse. He did die. Yeah, wake up, shy. Oh my god. Really like the corner pressure by Dash. He should be able to get the stock here. No, not quite. Great DI from Juicebox. Could have used one more shine. Oh, but then he just goes to ledge. All right, Dash able to close it out. Oh, tries to call out. Oh, that was so crazy. Yeah, I actually can't believe Dash made it back. I think Juicebox had all the right ideas to call out the movement off stage, but just couldn't quite get the needle to hit. Very He's gonna nice. close it out. There we go. Uh, <laughs> Dash is also pretty good at using Fox Invincibility. He called out Juice Box's uh, escape options a couple times now. Dash with a huge punish on a big tech flub from Juice Box there. Got him near the ledge. Misses the grab, and now it's Tech Chase City. No, Juice Box is gonna drop it. Again with the down smashes. They're so scary. Huh. That was like a, if you could play those interactions side by side, it's like a adaptation in the dictionary. First time shine gets gets uh, grabbed, and then second time roll away. Like, super cool. Oh man, Dash with the drills, these low percent drills, gonna even up the game if Juicebox isn't careful. He clips him with the needle, but oh, he misses! No! He misses the fair! We said earlier his edge guarding was perfect. He hit it earlier that game and then drops it when it matters most. And after the dust settles, Dash is gonna come away with a 2-1 victory in that set.